Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be talking about Tenet's Chinese box office. So first of all, let us clear a quick news. Robert Pattinson got COVID-19 positive. It was tested positive. I mean, it's a bit funny, just a bit, that he's making the Batman and then he got infected by a virus that was said to be originated from the bats. So maybe during the shooting, he ended up eating a bat and something happened. Just, <laughs> just saying, okay, just saying. I don't know, I don't know. Just, just maybe it's a possibility, you know. There was a Chinese dude that made a, a bit of influence on him and this could have happened. I don't know. So we're going to be talking about Tennis Chinese box office. So here's the thing. A lot of people were like, Tennis is going to be a massive success in China. It, it, it has a lot of hope coming from China. But here's the thing. First of all, Chinese box office is not as big as people say it is. Now, I, I get it. It earns a lot of money, but you don't get it back. A movie earning 200 million in China could be the same worth as a movie earning 100 in UK. Because from China, you only get 25% of the money back. That is, that is a proven fact. Everyone knows that in China, you only get 25% of the entire money back. So even if you earn 100 million in China, you only get 25 back. And Tenet's budget is like more than 200 million dollars, 250, right? So it's very expensive. And to even make a reasonable amount of money from China, it has to earn like in hundreds, in hundreds, right? So now we have tenants opening weekend and Monday, the first weekday as well, and it's not impressive at all, not at all. The first day was $8 million on Friday, which is less, very less. I was expecting at least 10, at least, but it, it went even lower than that eight, because Tenet is not the usual movie that Chinese people go to watch. Like, put out a Fast and Furious movie, Chinese people are okay with it. They, they, they go and watch it in big numbers. Superhero movies, Chinese people love it. Transformers, big action blockbuster Hollywood movies that usually don't make sense when it comes to the plot, but Chinese people just love it. A lot of movies that don't work in the US box office that will really go on and work a lot of money in China. Because China usually just cares about the big blockbuster stuff going on, big robots fighting, monsters, Godzilla type movies. Those are the movies that Chinese people love to watch. Tenet is kind of different. I get it it's a massive budget movie, but Tenet's, I mean, you know what Tenet is. It's completely different. It's based on like some kind of theory, some time reverse, some shit like a time lapse, something like that. I haven't watched the movie. I, I, as soon as I watch, I could do a review too. So the opening day was $8 million, right? Second day, Saturday, $12 million, okay, that's kind of good. Then third day, it dipped again to $10 million, which is actually normal when it comes to the rise in the dip of Saturday, Sunday. That's how it usually works in China. But usually sometimes Sunday is as much as Saturday numbers or even higher if the movie is working really good in China, right? So if it earned $12 million on Saturday, the Sunday could have been even 15 So right now, the opening weekend of this movie is $30 million. 25% of that is 7.5. You know how much that is? That is too less. Despite 30 million being more than Tenet's 20 million US opening, the actual money that it comes back to the producers, the production company, is lesser than US. US from 20 million, they should be getting right now 10 to 12 million back. But from China, you only get seven and a half back. Now, what about the weekdays? The first weekday, Monday, earned just around three and a half million dollars, 3.3, 3.5. So total after four days, Tenet in China has made 33 and a half, approximately 33 and a half. And when you count how much of that is actually going back, it's only $8 million going back to the production studio and the producers. So right now, Tenet is in a hugely problematic situation when it comes to China. Tenet has to make at least, at least 100 to even get anything valuable from China because this is low. And usually if, if, if you're a trade analyst, if you've been seeing box office regularly, you know that in China, even doing twice your box office opening weekend is very hard. Movies don't even end up making twice. For example, Black Panther opened around more than $70 million in China, but ended up with just about 100, not even twice the 70 million. So it's pretty hard in China doing that. So this movie could end up at most 55, 60, at most. Unless if it really becomes successful next week and if it gets an even wider release, it could go for 100, but that's, that's pretty much not guaranteed at all. So I'm gonna be putting it 50 to 55, at most 60. So that's uh, the condition of the Tenet movie in Chinese box office. We're going to be talking about more movies in the future. So all you got to do is subscribe to the channel. We're going to be talking about different box office places, reviews, and talking about budget and profit and all those stuff. So all you got to do is subscribe. Comment in the comment section down below what other video you guys want me to do. And see you guys next time.